Welcome back. This is video number four. We're going to talk about recommended softwares and why we recommend each one. So back in the day, before a lot of these softwares evolved, you had to go to Amazon, you had to mess with all the technical buckets, and you would have to figure out all the technical documentation. But now, because there are softwares that all you pretty much have to do is get your secret and access ID connected to your Amazon account and to the software, the system will actually create the buckets for you within the program itself, which will walk you through step by step so you won't get lost. But with that said, Cloudberry Lab is one of the ones that we recommend and that we will be using in this particular video course. Now, to get here, you go to Cloudberry Lab dot com you click on products and you click on Amazon s3 now what we like about Cloudberry is they offer you a lot of good educational information so beyond this video course you can learn a lot and a lot of updated materials such as I'll show you later how you can get access to access policies or in other words ways to protect your Amazon buckets but beyond that, Cloudberry also allows you to connect to FTP or your website and other file hosting servers. So there is actually a free version which you can download. And then of course they have a pro version. So if you just want to start out with the free version first, and then you feel like you can upgrade to the pro version and you want to upload files at a faster rate, you can do that. The second software is S3, and same goes for that. It's only compatible with Windows clients. Now, the S3 browser, it also has a free version, which you can download. A lot of them are very, very similar, but produce the same results. Now, if you use a Mac computer, so another software that we recommend is cyberduck.io. That's cyberduck.io and when you go to the site as you can see this is compatible with FTP S3 as you can see it is compatible with both Windows and Mac so I just wanted to show you this if you are a Mac user now another option that you can take is by using the S3 Fox which is a plugin for Firefox so to get here, basically search for S3 Fox Firefox plugin, and you'll go here. Now, while this does allow you to connect and upload files for free, the problem with this is it doesn't have as many features as S3 Browser, Cloudberry, or the other programs have. So just keep that in mind when you are going through and deciding on which software is best for you.